Hey, what's going on everybody? So like, I'm gonna talk about two of my favorite things today. People, which is like absolutely one of my favorite topics to talk about because that gives me the leverage, that gives me the ability to enjoy things, do things. I'm gonna talk about Mary, who I absolutely love, right Mary? Yes. <laughs> yes, Mary was just yelling a minute ago at me. So, she's like the only person that like has the right to yell at me because she's our closer and she always has to be on. So she's like, every once in a while she tees off on me. But, but here's what I wanna talk to you about. It's kind of, it's towards the end of the day. I just got back to the office. I needed to get something here. And lo and behold, I know we can't pan around here, but if you look at this 10,000 square foot building I'm in, like literally, she's the only one here. And, and oh yeah, and then right behind the camera, Dave is doing this, like what the hell. But I think you're back here because Mary called you because she needed to witness something. So, <laughs> so anyway, so here's, Here's my point. Again, you know, the, one of the biggest questions I get all the time, especially as people are trying to grow, they're trying to expand, you know, they're trying to, uh, um, you know, do more deals is, you know, the, you can't do it without having more people. And so the, one of the top two or three questions I get all the time is, well, how do I choose the people? How do I choose the people? And it's one of my favorite topics to talk about. And sometimes when you choose people is one thing, but then how do you evaluate them once they're with you and I could just tell you what you see here with Mary sitting here killing it still actually in the how many new deals are we closing tomorrow that we don't even know about um two two new deals that I literally like at 12 o'clock today didn't even know about and now I stopped by here at the end of the day she pulled off two new closings for tomorrow so how do you evaluate somebody once they're with you they just do shit they just get stuff done they go above and beyond I mean the bottom line is I know we're kind of kidding around, but Bonnie, she didn't have to be here today, right now. I mean, every, almost everyone's gone. They took off. She could have taken off. She could have said these things came in too late or I got to go. I wasn't here. There was really no one here. There was very easy for her to disappear here and nobody would have said a word. But this is one of the key hallmarks of a great person on your team. They just get things done. And you don't have to really even ask them to get them done. You don't have to tell them, okay, well, here's the agenda or here's the one, two, three. They just get things done. And the word that, like when Mary started working with for me years and years ago, the word I always used with her was proactive. And it's my, one of my favorite words when it comes to people and evaluating people. It's, there's really only way to do, there's only two ways to do it. You're either reactive or proactive. Reactive means, you know, it's like, what the hell happens? You know, tell me what to do and I'll do it. Proactive means I know I got a job to do and I'm gonna get it done. I'm gonna figure out how to get it done. You know, I still want you to give me support, you know, all that kind of stuff, but I'm gonna get it done. And you know, the people you're working with, they're either reactive, they're kind of sitting back waiting for you to tell them what to do or waiting for things to happen or they're proactive and doing what needs to be done, even creating two closings that weren't even set up for tomorrow. So that's, that's one of the key things when working with people. So guys, look, if you wanna learn how to find incredible real estate deals, number two, if you wanna use all my money to buy those deals, if you wanna use my infrastructure, my people to help us fix the deals, and then we sell them together and we split the profits, then you need to be part of our partner-driven coaching program because that's what we do exactly with our partners across the United States. And as a side note, guess who's gonna be closing them? Mary. Mm -hmm. So that's, you know, people are like, well, how do I get a Mary? How do I get the, well, this is how you get them. You, you become part of our team and then the, the, these, these, uh, these people start working for you. So remember, two types of people. There's the reactive and there's a proactive. You gotta go with the proactive. You gotta go with someone like Mary. Say bye, Mary. Bye. <laughs>